Hi, peas and olive juice. I'm back and I'm still in a really good mood. I haven't gotten any responses yet for um, ideas for topics while I'm in this cuckoo mood of mine. So I had to come up with a few things. I hope that you think, um, I hope you guys will think are fun and want to do. Okay, if any of you have seen the actor's studio, you'll be familiar with James Lipton. And um, at the end of the interview, he always um, does this Proust questionnaire um, that was originated by um, French uh, television personality Bernard Pivot, or in French, Bernard Pivot. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, here are the questions. There's ten of them. Uh, first, what is your favorite word? Number two is, what is your least favorite word? Number three, what turns you on creatively, spiritually, or emotionally? What turns you off creatively, spiritually, or emotionally is number four. Number five, what sound or noise do you love? What sound or noise do you hate is number six. Number seven, what is your favorite curse word? Try to be creative. Number eight, what profession other than your own would you like to attempt? Number nine, what profession would you like not to do? Like, you know, what would be the worst idea of a job for you? Number 10, if heaven exists, what would you like to hear God say when you arrive at the pearly gates? Okay, I think that's going to be a fun, uh, a fun thing. We'll get to learn some things about each other. <clears throat> I had fun doing Dizzy Lizzy Beth's uh, five things. Hold on. So, um... Oh, by the way, I forgot to give her a shout out in my last video. Sorry. Shout out, Dizzy Elizabeth. Okay. Um, just listening to some tunes. Uh, hanging out online, chatting with people. I wish YouTube had a, um, a messenger section. It's so hard communicating, you know, just with comments and, and the emails. Because, you know, it's not like a flow of conversation. But anyway, if you guys have any other great ideas for topics, um, let me know. Uh, and if you haven't checked out that um, Lord Give Me a Sign video that's on my favorites on my channel, check it out because I'm telling you, it is good. And if anyone knows who is singing that, please let me know. Um, I don't know how long have I been on here now. Oh, I'm only three minutes in. Usually I gab. Okay. Oh, here's something I pulled out that uh, if you guys have seen my bipolar vlog, then you would have heard me talk about Mac. The one that broke my heart. Anyway, he gave me this once. It's called The Happy Spell. Happy magic is just the thing to make you want to laugh and sing. And inside contains an authentic nov novelty spell and instructions. And I guess what you do, I'm already in a pretty good mood, so I'm not going to do this now. I'm going to save it for a case of emergency. I forgot I had it. I would have used it like a trillion times so far if I remembered I had it. Okay, so there's a little candle in here. When I'm feeling sad and blue, now I know just what to do. Pass the spell, wait and see, for a happy chappy I'll then be. Light the candle, holding the magic stone in your right hand, and repeat this spell three times. Oh, it's my favorite color, green. <laughs> so anyway, that is interesting. A cute little thing, huh? Got Steve Miller playing in the background. <sighs> so, um, I'm 
still popped up on Earl Grey. <laughs> um, I guess I'll stop this here because I don't really know what to talk about, but I'm just in a good mood and I want to share it. So contact me.